What's up everyone? Today is day number three of your shred program and this is your 50 minute leg sculpt workout. So grab your dumbbells and let's get started. I'm so excited that you're here today for our leg workout. We've got 15 exercises that we're gonna rock through today. Circuits of three exercises at a time, three rounds through each one, okay? So grab your water and your sweat towel. Make sure you've got some space around you. I will be providing modifications for every move up here. So if you need to dial it back to a body weight move or a little bit smaller range of motion at any time, use this exercise, okay? It will be there for you. As far as my dumbbells, we've got everything from a walking lunge with a kickback, which will look like this. Okay, so that will probably be my lightest weight all the way up to a glute bridge where I'll put the dumbbell here, bridge it up, so that'll be my heaviest. I'm probably gonna range between 15 and for the glute bridge, 50 pound dumbbells. I'm also going to use my glute resistance bands today. So if you have yours, go ahead and pull them out. If not, check out the link in the description if you're interested, but otherwise all you need today is dumbbells, okay? Give me a big thumbs up if you are ready and let's get our legs warmed up, okay? Hinging down in front in three, two, one, let's go. Reach, give it a good hamstring stretch. I know you might be feeling the effects of day one's workout today. So, we're gonna stretch really well to get started, get nice and warm, and always, always, always listen to your body, okay? Anytime you need to turn a lunge into a squat because it's just not feeling good, do that, okay? Dial it back to lighter weight or no weight. Anytime you need to, do it, okay? Always push yourself, but listen to yourself as well, okay? Here we go, good. Heels to the glutes. And just let the foot kind of flip backwards. Good, three, two, and one. Open your arms across your chest, since you will be holding dumbbells today. Good. You can feel it in your back as you round across. Two, one, and fold it down. Place your hands on the floor. Kick your left leg back and right leg up. Let's stretch the hips out and the quads. There you go. Good, lift it up. Straight front leg, straight back leg. And go down again. Open your chest up if you can. Good, back down to a straight leg. Good, switch legs, come on over. Okay, left leg up front, right leg back. Give it a second, okay? Just move around, kind of go side to side if that feels okay for you. Good. We've got a good workout today. So we want to get nice and warm. Good, straighten your legs up. And let's go down one more time. Good, I will give you adequate rest, so don't worry. All right, we've got two rounds of 40 seconds of work, 30 sec or 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds rest. And our last round will be a 30 second round. 30 seconds of work, 15 seconds rest. Legs are straight, turn into the middle. Let's go inner thighs, good stretch. Okay, and in between each circuit of three exercises, after you finish all three rounds, we'll have a minute rest. So you've got rest. That means I want you to go hard in your work period. Good, three, two, and one, roll it up nice and slow, and let's just take some body weight squats. Okay, sit back and down. Good, come up onto the toes if it feels good. Three, two, and one. How you feeling? Good? Just roll your ankles around. There we go. It's gonna be a good strength workout, okay? Have an option for jumping in one exercise. Other than that, we're gonna stay on the ground and push for our strength, okay? I wanna show you the first three exercises and then we'll rock through. First one, imagine I have a dumbbell right here. Squat and turn. So you're here in the middle, then you go to the right, then you take it to the back, and then you turn here, okay? Each rotation, you'll go back the other way, and then the other way, okay? So four point turn. 
second one is a sa slide squat and abduction lift, okay? So you're here nice and wide. You're gonna slide, up, lift. Slide, up, lift. So you're sliding into the squat, lift up top. Last one, squat and dumbbell arch over. Imagine I have a dumbbell again, taking it outside of my leg. Up, sit, up, sit, okay? So I'm gonna grab one dumbbell. I'm gonna start with my 20 for round number one and we're gonna go together in 10 seconds. All right, feel free to add a glute resistance band here if you want or just your dumbbell, okay? Let's go, three, four point squat turn. Here we go. Good, nice strong back. When you get to the front, squat there and turn the other way. Great job, breathe every rep. 20 more seconds. Good, 12, 11. Four, three, keep going. Two, one, rest, good. All right, take this dumbbell and you're taking a wide stance, okay? Slide, squat, lift. Slide, squat, lift, okay? If you wanna grab a glute resistance band, you can. Four, three, two, slide it over. Squat, lift. Good. That's it, basically when your dumbbell gets right in front of your shin, stand it up and lift that heel. Good job, 20 seconds. Nice. 10, seven, six. Three, two, one, and rest, good. Dumbbell is here now. You've got a narrow position. You're coming here and up. Here and up. Modification is right here in front of your shin. Okay? Whew. Let's go in four. Three, two, one. Come on. Here, up and over. Good. And make sure you're not just bending like a deadlift, okay? You are seated here. Good, dig the heel down. Twelve, eleven. Three, two, one. Great job. And we're back to squat and turn. Round number two, same thing, okay? Let's go up to 45 seconds of work. A little less rest, a little more work time. We go in four, three, two, four point squat turn, let's go. Good, come on. It's gonna be a fun workout today, as long as you think of it in a way that says, I'm getting stronger, okay? I'm doing this for me, because I deserve it, because it feels, whew, feels good. Almost lost the dumbbell. Keep going. <laughs> Almost a loud bang, got it. 13, 12. Good job. Nine. Good job. Three, two, one, good. All right, like I was saying, you deserve this. You deserve this good feeling of I show up, I work hard, I leave feeling proud of me, okay? Let's go, slide and lift. Two, one, and we're over. Slide, stand, lift. Now don't forget the stand, don't come here and lift, okay? You just slide over, fully extend, then lift. Good job. Good. 
Nice work, come on. Drive that heel up. Nine, eight, keep sliding down, 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 down with your butt. And then stand, four, two, one, and breathe, rest for 15. And we've got that last round of squat, arch over. Just a little torso twist, okay? A little transverse action. Four, three, two, one, let's go. Set it down, up and over, down, up and over. There we go. If you wanna step this up, you can also do a single leg squat, okay? As long as you don't let your knee cave in, okay? It stays nice and stable. Good. Thirteen. Focus. Work hard. Focus. Six. Five. Three. Two. One. And rest. You've got fifteen seconds. And we go thirty seconds for your last round. Meaning, bump it up if you can. All right, I'm gonna take my 30, and we're going in four, in three, four point turn. Let's go. See if you can stay pretty low this time. Good, stay moving, come on. Good, 10, nine, stay squatting. Three, come on, two more. Two, one, breathe. Good, slide it over, lift the leg. All right, ready? Three, two, one, let's get it. Sit, stand, lift. Nice work, come on. Think about your hips, sitting back and down, and then fully extending. You've got 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one, rest. Woo. All right, last one. Taking it down, single leg if you want, or just side to side with the arch over. Four, three, two, all right, come on. Thirty seconds. Fifteen. Eight. Seven. Two. One. And breathe. You've got one minute rest. Whew. All right. Here we go. Circuit one is done. We move on to a bit of a lunge style circuit. Okay. So, we've got a lateral lunge with a slow optional adduction, okay? So, I'm gonna take my left leg first, okay? Say for instance, I go here, all right? I'm gonna push so hard that I'm able to transfer my weight back up here. And then I have the option to pull this foot all the way back in, so I'm working my inner thighs. Okay, so watch again. I go here, squeeze. Okay, just like if you had a slider on your toe, you'd squeeze it in using those adductors. Okay, so that's exercise one. Here, all right, let's go together. In three, just to the left. Two, one, come on, just to the left. Here, big push, pull. Down, big push, pull. Good. And it's gonna be the most beneficial. If you're trying to keep weight on this leg and pull and slide, you're gonna look like this, right? 
Your job is to push so hard that the weight transitions back to this leg. So all you have to do is pull, okay? Seven. Three, two, one, rest. Turn out lunge is next. Okay, so you're starting here in the middle. All right, you're gonna turn to the right, take your right leg out. Lunge, middle, turn to the left, open the left, lunge. Okay, let's go together. Three, two, one, turn up, bring the dumbbell here. And make sure everything is facing this side, okay? So don't leave your foot here and lunge here and try to go down. Turn all the way, lunge, reset. Good job, there we go. Eight, seven, Two, one, and rest. All right, single leg quad extension, circle out, okay? Since the left leg was lunging, we're gonna take the left leg straight back squat, okay? Watch again, flex. Straight out, brace, squat, okay? Let's go left leg, two, one. Flex it, circle it, and squat. Here we go. Flex, circle, sit. Good, come on. You want the right leg to be doing the work here. Seven. Three, two, one and rest, good. All right, we're back. Lateral lunge, lunging to the right now, okay? Lunge, shift, pull in, okay? Whew. Here we go. Four, three, to the right, two, one, let's go. Lunge, pull it in. Good, you're thinking, I need my heels to click back together. Good, and when you get to the top, think about cracking an egg right in your inner thighs or something, okay? Squeezing them together like they've missed each other. Good job, 15. Good, flex and squeeze. Six, five, two, one, rest. Good, turn out lunges. Okay, step it over. Make sure you're not going over there and when you get there, your feet are tightrope style, okay? You're here. Ready? Let's go in three, two, one. Turn it out, here we go. Good, the best thing that helps me is to think about I need to get my heel out there, okay? Heel toe. That way my knee is not pushing outward and then I can balance in that heel while also sitting, okay? And then pushing out of it. Heel toe, sit. Think about sitting behind your hip, okay? Or behind your knee. Good, four, three, two, one, rest. Good job. All right, we move on to flexing the right leg. Flex, take it around, support the single leg squat, okay? The whole point is to get the quad working, and then on the way around, the glute, and then this quad. Ready? Three, two, one, flex. Take it around, support the squat. Let's go. Good, hold your hand out here. Balance, find one spot 
on the wall that you're staring at the whole time. And you continue to push that heel down into the floor. Okay, so it should never be a squat where you are here first. It should be, I'm gonna sit my hips back away from my knee first, then go down. Good, come on. Two, one, rest. All right, 30 per side here. 30 seconds per side. So we start with that lateral lunge to the left. Pull in. 30 seconds there, right over to 30 on the other leg. Ready? Let's do it, to the left. Pull. Good, you've only got 30 seconds, so give me a good pull. Good. All right, 15 more seconds. Good, four, get ready to switch to the right. Three, two, one, right side, let's go. Good. Lead back, trying to get your heel to your heel, okay? Big push. 15. Good. Two, one, and beautiful. 30 seconds of your turnout lunge. You just do 30, okay? Here, here, and then we'll hit 30 of each on that last quad extension single leg squat, okay? Step out lunges, two, one, let's get it. Remember, heel toe, you sit back down behind your knee. Good work, keep it moving. 10. Four, three, heel toe, two, one, good. Okay, now single legs. All right, remember you're taking it up, flex, flex, just support the single leg squat. Let's go in three, two, one. All right, flex the left leg, circle and support. Good. There you go, now try to keep it up. This foot, until you support. Find one spot, stare at it. Try not to be creepy and just stare at you the whole time. <laughs> I'm looking right in front of the tripod. You've got five, three, two, switch it over on your next one. Here we go. Reacquaint yourself with your balance, then go. Good, that's it. Core is tight. Don't forget about that. That's your whole balancing strength. Ribs and hips stacked. Good, let's go for 10 more seconds just to account for that transition time. Six, five, three, two, one. Finish the rep you're on and rest. Beautiful. Okay, a minute rest again. Two circuits down, let's start on the third one. All right, so next move we have a low hold squat and clean, okay? You can use two dumbbells, you can use one dumbbell. You're here, hold it low, stand, clean it up to your chest, squat again, okay? Take it back down, low, stand as you clean, squat again, okay? So you can use one dumbbell or two dumbbells for that one. All right, I'm gonna use my 220s. All right, 40 seconds of work, and we're going in 10 seconds. All right, low hold, clean, front squat. Okay, let's go. Three, two, one, come on. Back down, reset, power, sit. That's it. Make sure you don't turn that low sumo squat 
into a deadlift. Okay, hips don't go back, hips go down, chest is up. Then bring your hips forward. Good job, seven, five, three, two, last one, good. Okay, walking lunges and kick back. All right, I'm gonna take one dumbbell here. You're gonna step, back leg lifts. It becomes your front leg, okay? Let's go, I'm using my 20, two, one, step it out. You can also go here. So that kick leg then becomes the front leg. You'll have a little bit of a hinge here. See this position? A little bit of a hinge to get this kick back, then straighten back up for the lunge. Good job. Five, two, one, and rest. Good. Romanian deadlifts are next. Two hands, two legs. I'm gonna start with my 25s, okay? Just hinging, just like it sounds, right here. Okay? Let's go in three, two, one, come on. Good, power hips back forward. So make sure you're not bending and relaxing here, and then just kind of standing up, okay? Pull those shoulders back, hinge, hips to the dumbbells again, okay? 14, you're doing great, breathe. Five, four, two, one, yes! Whew, sorry about that. Loud clang. All right. We're back to that low squat hold and front squat. Okay? Low squat, clean it up top. Front squat. Whew. All right, you're doing great. Here we go. Two, one. Come on. Low, clean, sit. Make sure you don't forget to drop your hips. Okay? It's not a here, okay? It is a squat. You sit down, holding here. Bring them up top, you sit down again. Nine. Three, two, one. All right, let's get those kickbacks in. Come on, you're doing great. Your mind might be telling you, oh, slow down, this is hard. Your body's saying, we promised we would challenge ourselves this month. We would not give up, we would not quit. We're listening to the body right now. Four, lunge and kickback. Two, one, let's rock, I'm with you. Think about the glute squeeze. Ah. Think about trying to get your glute to travel up your back, okay? That's how you wanna flex it. Good quality here. Good, 10 more seconds, you doing okay? All right, good, me too. You're like, why do you ask me these questions and then you answer me? yourself. Two, one, rest. Romanian deadlifts, we're back. Pay attention to your body, to your form. Okay, you're tired already, so you're like, man, this isn't as heavy as I normally go on deadlifts. You are over halfway through a 50 minute workout, so form is everything. Two, one, let's go.
That's it, feel the stretch, dig the heels down, pull the shoulder blades back, drive forward. Right before you start that come up, make sure your ribs and hips don't relax, okay? Seven. There we go, come on. Three, one more. Two, rest. Okay, let's go. Last round, we've got a squat and clean and front squat. Can you jump up and wait? Only 30 seconds. Let's go in five. I'm gonna go to my 25s to challenge myself. Let's go. Good. You're right there. 10. Four, three, two, one, rest. Good. Okay, walk it out, lunges. Lunge and kick back. Five. I'm gonna use 125. Two, one, let's go. Come on, stay moving. Lift it, step right into it. Good job, 12. Come on, squeeze hard. Six. And rest. Romanian deadlifts. Come on, if you can jump up and wait, let's go. And then, minute rest. Let's go. Three, two, one. Dig the heels in. Making my way back up. Anyone just think of that song? Making my way downtown. Stay focused. 15. Come on, we're strong. Yes, we are. Five. Let's go one more together. Three, two, one. And breathe. Whew. You've got a minute rest. Grab some water. You're doing fantastic. We've got glute bridges to start, okay? Let's go in 30 seconds. Glute bridges. Put your band on, get your heavy dumbbell, do a combination of both, do neither. We're just bridging together right here like this. Okay, I'm gonna grab my 30 and a band, heavy band. Okay, listen to your body. If you're sore, do this to the best of your ability and we rest. Ready, let's go. Good, put enough distance between your heels and your glutes so that when you get to the top, you can feel your hips and your glutes tucking under, okay? If you get to the top and you're here, you feel like you can't even fully extend your hips, see how it's still bent? You're too close. Scoot it away, we go here. Okay, get up there, squeeze from the bottom to lift and then squeeze harder at the top. Five. Three, two, one, stay right here. You're gonna go two more rounds right here. All right, we're gonna burn the glutes out and I'm gonna give you a chance to breathe here. <sighs> Round two, if you can go up, we're going in seven seconds. Are you ready? All right, come on, three, Two, I'm with you. One, squeeze from the bottom, let's go. And I don't mean from your physical bottom, I mean from the bottom of this range of motion. Squeeze down here, like you're picking something up off the ground and then you're lifting it and then you're crushing it at the top. There you go, grab it, lift it, crush it. Grab it, lift it, crush it. That could be a song, right? Grab it, lift it, crush it. 12, 11. Good job, let's go for 
Let's go for seven more seconds. Ready? Lift it up and hold. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest for 15. You've got one more round. Okay? We're staying right here. Breathe. Breathe. Third round, glute bridges. We hold for 30 seconds. Lift in two, one, and go. Okay, so we're taking out the grab and lift and we're just crushing. Something is between your cheeks right now, like a walnut or something that makes you laugh, okay? Squeeze it harder. Now a little bit harder. You've got 15 seconds. I know you could squeeze harder. Come on, even harder. Nine, eight, yes, everything's shaking. Squeeze harder. Five, four, come on, three, two, one, and beautiful. Rest, obviously. <laughs> okay, good work. Stand up, take your band off. All right, we're gonna go sumo squat hops with two butt kicks, okay? There are options here. So, the movement is a sumo squat, okay? You're gonna come down in that sumo squat, keeping your chest up, kick, kick, hop, down, kick, kick, hop. You can take the hop out, you can take the kick at the bottom out. So if you wanna dial it back one level, go here and stand. You wanna dial it back two levels, go down, up, kick, down, up, kick. Pick your level, okay? Let's go in 10 seconds. If you wanna use a dumbbell, you can. If you wanna use a band, you can. I'm gonna try this with my 20. Uh, two, one, let's go. Let's see how it goes. Here, here, a little hop. Good. This can be body weight, it can be no jump, whatever you need right here. lunges alternating left then right if you're not familiar or comfortable with curtsies you just take it reverse lunge okay all right so in seven seconds you go here okay three two one let's go don't leave your hips opening this way you want your hips to stay forward your leg goes back and then it's just slightly Shift it outward. Hips stay facing the front. Good, keep the heel down in the front. Doing okay? Good. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. Whew. All right, back to your sumo squat. Kick, kick, butt kick, butt kick, and hop. Ready? Let's go in five, three, two, one. Try to give me your other foot first on this round. The point of the butt kick is to keep you down and shift your weight from left to right, and you're still down, then you explode. <sighs> Come on, quads. I know, eight, seven. <sighs> Two, one. <sighs> Curtsy lunges. If you can go up, let's do it. Okay, dumbbells either at your side, at your chest, or on your back. Four, three, two, one. Come on, 45 seconds. Right here. That's it. You're doing great.
Breathe. I'm taking my time to breathe as well. Here you go, 15. Seven. Three, two, one, rest. Okay, last round of these two. 30 seconds each. So if you wanna take the weight out, speed it up, that's what I'm gonna do. We go again in eight seconds, big deep breath. Butt kick, butt kick, hop. I'm doing this body weight. Do what challenges you. Let's go. Good job, 15. Can you speed it up? Can you get higher? lunges for 30 and we've got one circuit left ready three two one curtsy let's get it Whoop. think about sitting in your front leg just like a squat come on 15 Make any kind of faces you need to. <laughs> Just caught myself going, cool. <laughs> Five, three, two, one. Okay. <sighs> Grab water. You've got 30 seconds. <sighs> We've got three exercises left. Three rounds of 30 per exercise. Exercise one, just like always, but especially here, technique is everything. Okay, so this is a reach back Romanian deadlift. All right, I've got my 220s. I'm holding them kind of face down. I'm going to dig my heels in as I hinge. I'm gonna attempt to tap my dumbbells right beside my heels. Okay, notice my back, still flat, still flexed. I'm not here. Okay, so let's go here and stand. Touch back here, stand. Okay, two, one, let's go. Reach it back, drive. Don't let your shoulder blades separate from each other. Good, if you're getting down there and your shoulders go, you're doing it wrong, okay? Shoulder blades are reaching for each other. Hips are reaching back for the wall behind you. And then they're reaching for the wall in front of you. Back, front, and rest. You've got two more rounds of that. If you can go up, let's do it. We go in eight. Four, two, one. Touch it back, let's go. Here, power forward. You can also do this with a kettlebell. Really stretch it, really squeeze it. Ten. One more, four, dig those heels in. Three, two, rest. One more round of 30 seconds. I'm gonna stay right here with this weight. If this is bothering you, just give me a regular deadlift, okay? Or some kickbacks, all right? A little bit less impact, but we're still getting the glutes. Let's go, last round right here, come on. Don't crane your neck, so don't be here, okay? Keep it, chin close to your chest. 10, four, three, two, one, rest. 
Move these guys out of the way. We're dialing it back. We've got a couple burnout moves here. Okay, fire hydrant to squat walk. Not at the same time. Okay. All right, so fire hydrant. I'm gonna come down to one end of my mat. For 30 seconds, I'm right here. Left and right. At the end of that 30 seconds, I go like this, and I just squat walk. I keep going until this next 30 seconds is over. As soon as it is, I'm down again. Okay? Non-stop, 30, 30, 30, 30. Let's go. Three, two, one, lift it out. Right and left. Keep your hands nice and wide so that you can balance. I'll tell you when your 30 seconds is almost up, as soon as it is, you can roll back onto your legs, stand up and squat walk, or just squat, just stay right there. Nine seconds and we're standing and we're walking. Five, one more each leg, ready? Right, left, stand up, let's go. Good, or you can go here, okay? Whatever you choose, knees are fighting against each other. They hate each other right now. They're like, I cannot, cannot be near you. Fight them away. This one's trying to run away. This one's trying to come and get it. And then they switch. Okay, I'm doing, many, doing too many hypotheticals. Five, four, get ready to drop back down. Two, one, let's go. Good job, push through the burn. I know you're feeling it. I'm feeling it too. We're not gonna stop. We've got 12, 11. Straight out from the hip, not backwards. Five seconds and you're back to a squat walk. Three, two, one. Come on. Stay low. Pull the core in, okay? Let that sweat fall, you've earned it. You knew what I was gonna say right there, right? You have, you're here right now because you have well beyond earned your sweat. 10, nine. Get ready to drop it down. Five. Next time you drop down, only the left leg. Two, one, left leg only for 30. Yep, then we're doing right leg only for 30. Then we're squat walking for a minute. That's it. That's it, as in, that's all simple, right? No, I know that's not simple, but that's what, that's all we've got left, I should say. Come on, 10 seconds and you switch legs. Five, four, come on, give me one more with this leg. Next time you put it down, you switch. Let's go. Thirty seconds on this leg, then you hop up for a minute of squat walking. Good job, ten. Are you ready for that squat walk minute? I'm gonna switch it up for you. Five, four. Come on up in three, two, one. Rest. Okay, walk it out. Let's go. Good. Ooh. Come on. Good. Stop right here where you are in a squat. Take that left leg out, out. Unless you don't have a band, then you just keep squatting. Left leg only, come on. Nine, you're gonna resume walking. In five, four, three, two, one. Walk again, unless you've been walking, keep on walking. Good job, stop here in the middle. Give me just the right leg. Out, out. Good, hold the left leg right here. Ow, I know it's burning. Hold, three, two, walk again, let's go. Come on, give me eight, seven, six, Five, fight for it. Three, two, one, and 
Oh my gosh. Hands on your knees. Breathe, you have made it to your cool down. There are no tricks. That's it. You've made it to your cool down. Whew. So proud of you. Have a seat. Come on down. Let's go to your hands and knees first. Push your hips back, child's pose. Reach those hands forward. Let your glutes stretch. Let your back relax. Take the forehead to the mat if you would like. Big deep breath in, fill your lungs up big. Exhale. Slowly bring your way back up to tabletop. Forward and backward with your hips. Side to side with your hips. Good, walk it forward, drop your hips down to the floor. Give it a little pressure in the back. <sighs> I don't even know what to say right now. <laughs> way to push, way to challenge yourself in terms of variety. Now, here's one of the most important things. Recover, okay? You cannot, until the next workout, sit and wait for the soreness to go away, all right? Come back into hands and knees. I want you to walk back to your knees, tuck your toes down, Keep walking, you're in a deep squat now, okay? Drive your knees outward, either by going here or here, leaning on your elbows, just open up your inner thighs. Do not sit and wait for the next workout to be your movement, okay? You need to foam roll, you need to stretch, you need to get up and walk around every hour, okay? That's how your body recovers best. Movement, blood flow is the key here, blood flow. Getting nutrients to your muscles, to help it repair, help repair those micro tears, that's how you recover best. Lift your hips up, heels down, walk your hands out a little bit if you can. Stretch the back of your legs. Okay, don't sit in your office chair or go from office chair to couch to bed, back to office chair and then you work out. Okay, you've gotta move. I know it's not as easy when you're at home. Slowly roll it up. You just gotta make it a point, okay? Get out for a 20 minute walk in the middle of the day, okay? Pull your heel to your glute. If you need to grab onto a wall, do that, okay? So just speaking on recovery today, you've gotta make sure that your muscles, as we create these little micro tears through workouts, they get nutrients, meaning you've gotta eat well, you've gotta eat enough to fuel these workouts. And I want you to move outside of the workout, okay? I don't want you to sit. I want you to foam roll, I want you to stretch, I want you to do some mobility work, some yoga, go out for a walk, go for a bike ride, okay? Switch legs. All right, recovery happens in the time between the end of your workout and the start of the next one. That's where all the good stuff happens and that's where you can optimize how well you recover, okay? Adding on another 60 minute workout, not gonna optimize your recovery for strength training, okay? For your lean body mass retention, I need you to foam roll, I need you to walk, I need you to get enough sleep, and I need you to get enough food, okay? Put your hands on your tailbone, big push forward. Great job. Grab onto your hands, I want you to think about pushing your palms away from you and releasing your shoulder blades away from your back. Lean your left shoulder over. Lean your right shoulder over. Open it up. All right. Amazing work today. I really think that workout in itself showed you how strong you are. Okay, I think I kept you focused with good variety, good circuits, good challenges. And you're here now because you worked hard. You did this. No one else did this for you. You did it. I did it alongside you. I showed you what to do. You put in the work, okay? Whether that was modifications, you sit out for an exercise just to breathe again, you stop the video, you keep going when you can, whatever. It's not about perfection. It's about you start, you do your best all the way through, and we are right here together because we finish together. All right, that's what teammates do. So I, as your trainer, also feel like your teammate. I want you to know that you're never, ever alone in this journey. I'll be here for you tomorrow, and the next day, and the next day, and the next day, and have so much faith in your abilities. I have so much faith in what you can do. If you truly believe in yourself, you truly hold yourself as valuable, and you hold yourself as a priority, okay? Believe, 
Prioritize value. Believe you can. Prioritize the things that help you. Do that so that you can. And then recognize that you're worth that effort. You're worth that thought process. You're worth more than that. But if I can get you to at least say, I'm valuable enough to focus on my own health as a priority, then I'll keep working on building your confidence and your own self-worth, okay? But we've got to know we are worth this time. We are worth eating well. We are worth sleeping well. We are worth thinking mentally. We're great. You're doing incredible. You're worth this. You're capable of this. And we believe in our abilities above all else, okay? So believe in yourself that you can. Prioritize yourself and you will and then value yourself knowing that you are worth it. Okay, I'll see you right back here tomorrow. Don't forget to engage with the video in some way. It helps us out so much, helps get these workouts to more people all over the world at no cost to them. I just want everyone to have access to these workouts, okay, because they all deserve it. You deserve it. So I'll see you back here tomorrow. Make sure you give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, comment below, let me know what you truly thought and how your quads are feeling, and I'll see you back here tomorrow. I'm gonna go foam roll. Just watch me.